wanted to test these deflection uh, high voltage color display chips because we're moving toward flat screen and away from CRT you can find these chips everywhere if you look they're surplus they're used to control the horizontal deflection output of the CRT and they're rated at about 15 amps at about 700 volts now the Fairchild one which is an FJL69201 that's rated at max amperage is 30 amps average amperage is 20 amps and they're rated up to 1600 volt high voltage spikes and they run at about 800 volts normal they're all PNP chips so you can find these chips surplus and I got some incredible reading I did use a transformer as you can see back there and the transformer could have been interfering with that in a negative way because I got a higher amps on the output than I got on the input and over years of doing this guys the, the first time that happens is not worth freaking out over there's usually a good reason why and I always want to explore it further before I start raising the flag I've done something incredible I don't expect that so for now it is a little higher but Obviously, the quality and output was incredible. The amperage was a lot higher on the output, and the RPMs of the wheel was over 3,000 RPM. So I've been looking for high switching chips. These are not rated like high switching, but if you look at the spec sheet, they're in the same range as the high switching chips because they're controlling a CRT, and they have to be able to control that in a fine measure by turning on and off real quick. I suggest you look at the CRT chips, they're surplus, and I'm getting some great readings. Uh -huh.